Hello and welcome to the Sensei Lanai Four Seasons Hotel Resort. I'm gonna show you a little tour, come walk with me. And we're gonna walk through the estate, the grounds, with beautiful landscaping. I'm gonna give you a tour. It's about five o'clock, so we're nearing sunset with that beautiful golden hour. Let's go tour the grounds. Come with me now and we'll check it out. All right, hello, good morning. We're gonna walk into the main part of the Sensei Lanai. I just wanna show you some of the artworks that are around here. I have another blog post on my website that's entirely about the sculptures and the art here on the property. I'd estimate there's over $100 million worth of Boteros. There's a Jeff Koons that's in the lobby. Absolutely incredible, incredible collection. You can see many of the Boteros out here who's a Colombian artist, famous for these absolutely enormous sculptures. This is uh, Adam and Eve over here. You may have noticed these. I used to live in New York City, and these were in Lincoln Center. Another version of these were in the Lincoln Center lobby. All right, but let's go inside the beautiful lobby of the Sensei Lanai Four Seasons Resort and Hotel here in the island of Lanai, Hawaii. I'm filming this walk around video. My family and I are staying here for a couple nights. You know, my sister and her husband actually brought us here. Ugh. Is all of my speaking annoying? Let me know in the comments. If you don't mind it, give me a like and say hello. Here it goes. Good morning. morning. Alright, here is the lobby. And I want to show you, okay, this is the Jeff Kuhn sculpture that was installed, I think, December of 2021. And I just love the vibe of this incredible lobby. I did a walkthrough video coming into the lobby before, and that was where we came out. The library is right back there. I'm going to go back there later to show you a tour of the library. These fireplaces are lit up at night and it's just a beautiful spot. Both of those two chairs facing the fireplaces, a highly recommended spot to sit and enjoy the evening, maybe while you're waiting for your dinner reservation or something. This fireplace is going at night. Gosh, I wish I would have filmed it. I love hanging out on these lobbies. This is where the welcome area was when we arrived. I just love this place. Beautiful ceilings and that very expensive Jeff Koons sculpture that takes pride of place here in the lobby. Let's step outside. Oh gosh, I don't want to bother them in the restaurant, but I think I might go ahead and give you a peek. I'd be remiss if I didn't show you this sculpture. It does look oblong or strange. It is by the same artist as the large head sculpture in the back. I forgot the individual's name. Here in the lobby, Nobu by Sensei is in the back. We're gonna walk out there. You can sit outside, by the way, and have your breakfast out on the patio. I've seen many people doing that. Today, though, there's a little bit of rain, so it looks like not many people are doing that. I'm gonna peek in here. Wow, I'm just noticing the other version of this apple, which you may have seen previously on my video tour. Looks like this is a sushi bar. I'm not gonna go into the lobby of the restaurant. I don't wanna bother people, but I'll peek in real quick. Good. Good morning, how are you? Can I just take a video in here real quick? Yeah, of course. Bro. Awesome. Thanks very much. Good morning. Good morning. All right. Well, I'll give some privacy to the other guests, but I will just show you real quick a look at the restaurant space. The beautiful restaurant. I'm actually shocked that nobody is in here right now. I think everybody must be out on adventures or sleeping in a little bit. Oh, there's a gentleman.
I'm gonna walk back out now and show you outside this area as we walk through the lobby. Now that I think about it, I'm here. I'm, I'm gonna peek into the bar and show you the bar area. The light will not be as good, but I will give you a peek. Thanks for watching my tour of the Sensei Lanai Four Seasons Resort and Hotel. All right, I sped it up a little bit to take you to the bar here. It's on the opposite corner of the restaurant. Here it is, the garden bar. And we'll take a peek inside. I can only imagine at night the beautiful fireplace sitting over there. Wow, the pillows on this just look so lush. There are some snacks set up, a grab and go daily breakfast, as you can see, with some of these tasty treats as well as other snacks and packages. What's up, honey? What can I do for you? Good morning, I was just taking a little video. Is that all right? Just film video, is that okay? Yeah. Okay, cool, thanks. All right, I'm gonna go over now to show you the library. Folks here are super friendly, by the way. No problems at all with me filming the video. We're back at the cherry sculpture that I like so much. And I'm gonna take you into the library. Good morning. To show you what is inside here in the library. Let's see if there's nobody in there. Wow. This is the library. And I'm gonna tell you, it is my favorite hotel library that I have ever been to. Why is it? Because the books are curated so well. There's an incredible collection of books on this library all throughout. They are not secondhand books that were just left behind by people. These are all brand new, high quality, very thoughtfully curated books on a variety of topics. I will say they're overwhelmingly nonfiction and they are books that really people have thought about. Okay, maybe that's one fiction book, but I promise you there are coffee table books. There are books about surfing. There's books about resorts around the world. There's books about the secret lives of planets and outer space. I'm just telling you that if you are a reader, you are going to love coming here to the library at the Four Seasons Sensei Lanai. The collection is absolutely fantastic. There also is a Domino's set. There is a Checkers set. Sorry, there's a chess. Is this chess? I'm sorry. There's a chess set. There is a Domino's set, a very high-end, fantastic construction of Domino's. We played this last night with my sister. Can I open this here? Here are the Domino's. And then, oh gosh, please don't make fun of me if I don't know what this game is. Is this backgammon? What game is this? Please let me know in the comments. Another set here, fantastic collection. We saw people playing board games here before, and that was nice. All right, this is the library. I'm now gonna take you outside to visit some of the grounds, and I'll show you the view as you get out through the back. Beautiful, beautiful gardens.
Good morning. The sun looks like it is peeking through out here. It's going to break through the clouds any minute, and when it does, I'm going to resume the video to take you on a walk through some of these trails. I have turned my camera wide angle, and I'm worried that we're losing the light a little bit, but I'm gonna show you. There's nobody at the pool right now. The hotel's almost full, but I guess it's dinner time, so nobody's out at the pool. Even when the hotel is full, though, you don't really notice people. There's not a whole lot of guest rooms available, so it still feels like a really private experience as you explore this magical Hawaiian paradise. That is a banyan tree right back there. Let's see what else we can find. These are the hot tubs. Now there are many onsens throughout the location. Onsen is the hot tub area. That is, I think, a massage studio. But the onsens are actually located way far back that way. This is the other side of the pool. So the pool goes like a U horseshoe shape. Oh man, I'm worried I've lost the light now. And the colors just don't look as good. It might be about to rain. My viewers that are watching this video, I wanna say thank you for watching. I might pause the video and restart it when I can get some better lighting. For now, we'll walk back in the jungle here. These are the little beach, uh, sorry, lay down, what are they, seat areas by the pool where our family came today to sit by the pool and read and enjoy the beautiful pool oasis. As you can see, each of these areas really are very private. We felt like, wow, there's that huge banyan tree I mentioned before. Beautiful right near the pool. The view here at sunset. Well, it's a cloudy day. I think I am losing my light. So I'm gonna pause it as we wait and explore the beautiful Sensei Lanai. Hey, hey, my name is Nick and I'm gonna give you a room tour of the new room I just moved into here at the uh, Sensei Lanai, a Four Seasons Resort Hotel here on the Hawaiian island of Lanai. Let's go and check out, oh wow, dang, maybe I should have filmed it here. Okay, whatever. Let's go show you, I'm just gonna walk in this way and start the room tour. <laughs> I left all my luggage out here, like I'm walking in, check this out. Okay, 
kind of embarrassed doing these tours. All right, here's the room. It is a beautiful room. All the rooms have balconies here. Where to begin? I'll come back to the coffee station. This is the room now. What you need to know is that it is a king-size bed, obviously. There's two nightstands. Now, look, I'm always curious to know what, like, accoutrements are nearby the bed. And this has some sort of a... Uh, Touchscreen compatible menu. I imagine that it links up with everything. You've got your power ports over here, a telephone. Oh, this is neat. I learned about this from my sister's husband. This puts down these large uh, shades. Let's see if it goes down now. And these are complete and full blackout shades, which is really fantastic in this room. I think this is one of the greatest luxuries to have true, true blackout curtains inside of a room. And boy, oh boy, do I sleep so well when I've got these blackout. Let's see if they go. Oh my God, they go all the way down to the ground. Now look, I'm not gonna turn off all the lights, but this is, this is pretty good. That's an amazing blackout. All right, I'm gonna go back up. Can I just push this button to make them go back up? Okay, so we'll continue the room tour. I will show you what they gave me as the welcome gift. Here I am again, by the way. My name is Nick. I'll be your tour guide for this little room tour. Here's the welcome kit that they gave us. Uh, you can see some nice fruit platter, some delicious bread in here, two bottles of Fiji water, and that's it. I'll do a little more tour to show you the balcony. In order to do that, I will raise up the blackout curtains again. Hey, this is the second hotel tour video that I've made, and I'm gonna try to do it long to show you a little different, but just all of the things like you're visiting here as well. If you like it, will you do me a favor and just press the like button or just add a comment? I don't do these for ads or anything. Anyhow, here's the view. Um, that is the main central room. You can see some more of my videos to show a tour of that. It's incredible. The gardens are absolutely fantastic. I feel like I'm whispering because I don't want to be annoying. Let's go back into the room. We'll do more of that and the other stuff. Into the room again. Showing you the enormous television. The fantastic seating area if you want to get a little work done. I know I always try to get some work done. Nice little <laughs> potential sleeping area if things don't... Oh, Actually, I wonder if this is a, this could be a sleeping area. Is, this isn't like a fold out. No, this is just a little sofa thing. Oh, please don't make fun of my video. All right, so this is a seating area. So many seating areas here. Let's take a look inside the closet. As you know, the ultimate test is, are we gonna get some bathrobes? No bathrobes here, but maybe they're in the bathroom. What do we got in the area? We got an iron. We got plenty of hangers, slippers down here on the bottom. Lots of hangers, some nice ones. All right, so that's it there. We'll go take a peek. I'll show you the coffee station real quick, which is here. This is another closet. And this is your refrigerator. Okay, so you got your refrigerator down here. You can fill it up with whatever you want. And then the typical coffee station here with your Nespresso pods and things like that. A beautiful fresh flower from the garden. And more of these beautiful, beautiful stuff. They've done such a good job here. I tell you, I've only been here for a couple hours and I absolutely love this hotel. Inside the bathroom, yes, we got the bathrobe. I should have seen it before. More accoutrements over here. Some face bar and uh, moisturizers. Let's take a look at the shower, because that is one of, wow. I love that they've got that little shower seating here. More things in the shower. Looking up at this. Should I add music to my videos? Is it weird not to have any sounds? Let me know in the comments. This is the room tour. You're going to love this room. It's very spacious. I do note that there's a single sink only. The bathroom, oh, the bathroom, come on. Everybody knows the best part of the bathroom at this hotel are the Toto toilets. Watch it jump up as soon as you walk in. I'm sure if you're researching this hotel, you've heard all about these 
Toto toilets that are in every single one of the rooms here. I'm just gonna show you what you need to know, which is my mother got confused in her room. Here's how to flush it. When you come to one of these, if you haven't seen it before, the flush button is up on top, okay? And so you can press that in order to flush. And there's all the other features of a fancy Japanese toilet, of course, which is fantastic. So that's it. I think I'm gonna conclude the room tour at this part of it. Thank you very much. Where should I look? Thank you very much for watching my video so far. This is the... All right, the sun is coming out a little bit here. So I'm going to walk over towards the gym and try to give you an idea of what it's like just seeing some of this lush, lush landscape throughout the resort. I note the irony as I walk by some plants that are struggling. I am here during March what is today? Today's date is March 9th, 2022. And I don't know if this is the dry season or the rainy season. I apologize as your tour guide here. Oh my God, I forgot to tell you, there's so many butterflies all throughout the space. You may have seen the mask that I have in my hand. The mask mandates are about to be lifted. Hopefully by the time you're watching this, we're well beyond that. See some of these beautiful flowers that you'll find all over the property. My sister, oh my God, I'm gonna tell you guys a tip that you have to do, and actually you should do this in advance. You can schedule a walking tour with a professional botanist. His name is David. They may have others, but the one we did was with a gentleman named David, who will take you on about an hour long tour walking through the property and identifying and, oh my God, look at this bird. I have a bird app where I can identify these new birds. That might be a new one. Um, the botanist will walk you through the property telling you about all of these plants and special features of them. And he'll tell you what, for example, these things are called and he'll show you, he'll pick at them and show you stuff. Here's the thing though. You need to register it and request it in advance. We showed up, thankfully, they let us and allowed us to join the tour, but it was entirely full. I'll tell you a secret though, they said it was entirely full. Six people had signed up, that's the maximum, and four of them were no-shows. So I got to join it along with my mother and my sister. There are birds all over the place. The botanist told us that some of these birds will call you back. You can make noises and they will sing to you. I'm just showing you though, many of these have little name placards on them so you can learn more about which plant it is. 
and throughout the space, really. Oh gosh, if you like plants, you're gonna love this place. It's all over. I wish I could remember and tell you some of the fantastic facts that we learned on the tour with David. My sister told me, because she joined more of it than I did. These are not part of the sculpture, by the way. These were just like the landscape folks put these in. They're not part of Larry Ellison's incredible connection. This is a banyan tree. So what I was saying was my sister joined the tour a lot earlier than I did, and she said that some of the plants here that they have imported cost as much as a house. Some of them are so rare that they cost as much as an entire house. I'm gonna walk out of this little banyan tree type area and I'm gonna continue on to the gym. That is my goal, is to take you to the gym. I'm just, But I'll pan back just to show you. This is a whole path all back around behind the banyan tree up everywhere. One of the nicer, shadier spots throughout the Sensei Lanai Four Seasons Hotel and Resort. We'll come back to the path here and now walk towards the gym back there. This is the entrance to the pool, which is usually staffed. Again, it's pretty early this morning, so there's nobody here right now. We'll take a little peek. I don't want to disturb anybody. We were very happy with the pool service. I think I showed you the pool from from earlier. If not, I'll clip to another video. There's somebody here, so I won't really disturb them. Those are those little beach, or sorry, the little chair type areas, which there's multiple. One more flower here. Oh gosh, my video isn't perfect, but I'm trying to just show you a long, chill walk through the space. If you like this video, if this is helpful to you, will you please give it a like or a thumbs up, whatever on YouTube. I like making these videos. I go to a lot of high-end resorts. Like I said, I'm not sponsored. I just do this for fun. That like, if you like or follow my blog or whatever, I have a newsletter whenever I go to some other spots. All right, so the gym is over here. This is another sculpture. Gosh, this is a multi-million dollar sculpture. I'm gonna show you something that's a little, this is the water setup. I'll talk about that in a little bit. For now, I'm gonna go back into the gym. So those water setups that I mentioned back there are all over the property for some delicious, fantastically filtered water. And they are nicely designed. It's very good. Let's see. I'll make sure there's nobody inside of the gym so I don't bother anybody. I believe it's empty. Oh God, I hope this background music is not gonna ruin it on YouTube. I'm inside of the gym now and I'm showing you around. There are one, two, three, four Peloton bikes. A healthy collection of free weights as well as kettlebells. There's bottled water available over there. Excellent selection of free weights. I really liked, I did a rollout here after I did a bike ride, a Peloton ride. I appreciated that roller. I think that company is based out of Austin, Texas, which is where I live. So here's the gym. These are lockers, by the way. Rather self-explanatory, but oh my goodness. 
The gym here is incredible. Look at these rowing machines. Look at the treadmills. Look at this, they have a Smith machine. Several other weighted things. If you're watching this video right now, or if your trainer is watching this video, if you sent my video to your trainer, give me a like or a comment below. I know you, I feel you. You're trying to plan your workouts for this trip. Maybe you don't even have a plan to come into the gym on your trip. You just wanna enjoy your vacation. But gosh, I found that this was so nice just to wake up. I'm not gonna to try to convince you to go to the gym, but I am gonna tell you that a little bike ride here even for 10 minutes, a few minutes of weights made me feel so good. I loved it. All right, there's those Pelotons. And then we're gonna go right back out and continue our tour, walking through the paths of the Four Seasons Sensei Lanai. Good morning.
I have been waiting for this light all morning to show you. Thankfully it is peeking out and I am so happy to make this video. Let's get a little look at some of these flowers. This is the back of that banyan tree walking area way over there that I took you before. You can see how far back the path goes here to explore this beautifully landscaped jungle oasis that they've created. I'll walk a few steps into it, but my goal is to take you on the onsen tour. This does just look incredible. This is a this is quite a far cry from Texas where I flew in from. You know, I really struggled here thinking about how to show you on video between the amazing interior design of this resort, the fantastic restaurant, but then all of this that you're seeing, the grounds, the landscape, the art even, look at that one. I wrote an article on my blog about all of the sculpture here. I may have mentioned before, there's over a hundred million dollars of sculpture from Larry Ellison's private collection that has been integrated into the estate or the resort grounds. You can find that on my blog. I think if you search on Google for Nick Gray, Sensei Lanai, it should come up. I list all the sculptures and got a map with their locations on it as well. Speaking of one of these sculptures, oh gosh, I might as well just show you some of them now because we're right nearby. I forget, this is not a Botero. I believe this is a Balthazar. I forget the gentleman's last name. But my favorite one, I think is just back here. I'm gonna try to, well, of course, that's one of the best ones on the property. It, it is an orchid. I forget the gentleman's name. Reference my blog. All those bird noises are entirely natural. There are so many birds around here. There's the butterflies too. Did I mention the butterflies? Wow, they're beautiful. Where is that sculpture? Here's one of them I'll take you to. We'll take a peek over there. I actually need it. Oh, there's a lizard. Look at these sculptures. Just hanging out here. Just chilling. In this area. Absolutely incredible. I'm gonna try to take you now over to the onsens. It's the onsen area. Onsen is a Japanese hot tub. Is that the right word? I hope I'm not being disrespectful to call it a hot tub. It's a warm, oh gosh, there's people meditating over there or some sort of something. Onsens are these Japanese hot tubs that are scattered throughout this jungle area. I'll be very quiet. 
and their warm hot tubs in a jungle space. By the way, we're gonna go over towards here, the onsen garden. Before I go up to the onsen, let me just show you this one. Another one of these fantastic sculptures. All right, into the onsen garden. All right, I've switched into wide angle to take you into the onsen garden and show you what one of these looks like so you can get an idea of these hot tubs. What am I talking about? And a, a hot tub in the jungle I hope you can hear me on top of the roaring sounds of the waterfalls. There are many of them here. I, I don't even know how many. And I will show you one example of an onsen. So here it is, a beautiful private hot tub tucked away in the back of the jungle. And there are many of them back here many many of them the water is very warm it's not too hot but it's hotter than the hot tubs and you have a fantastic view looking out this is just one we'll try to find another one if you're looking forward to going on this trip to visiting this resort to see the onsens let me tell you you should be because they are fantastic. I came and explored this whole area with my family and we found a large one that's up in the back. Maybe I'll show it to you for all of us to enjoy and hang out. But let's check this other one. Which way? Uh, we'll go this way. Another one with a beautiful bench to enjoy and feel the nature. Should we go see the other one? I don't want to show you too many of them lest you get bored, but there are a lot. There's, so this is not for swimming. This is fresh water, but it's not for swimming. This is the onsen that you're meant to sit in and enjoy. As you can see, there's a lot of steps to get down in them. They all have convenient benches nearby. And the real treat is the view. Looking out into the jungle, this amazing landscaping that they've spent so much time and effort cultivate and create. There's plenty more up that way to explore. Maybe you'll check that out when you come here.
Hello. How are you? Hey, y'all. Good evening. <laughs> right. <laughs> it's beautiful here. There are walking paths all through this banyan tree area. My room is over in this way. Hello. We're gonna go into the lobby. Right here, let me show you this. We're going into the lobby. Oh, I realized I forgot to film this before. This is the morning coffee setup. Showing the coffee that's available, as well as some cream, sugars, and then your non-dairy options, and some decaf coffee. Next to the bar is the restrooms, and gosh, I hope nobody's in here, but I'm gonna show you just because the design, I was so impressed. I really love the look of these bathrooms the quality and I know the light doesn't look as fantastic right here but <clears throat> it does look good there's me by the way thanks for watching my video I oh gosh horrible lighting my family went out for breakfast and I said I'm gonna stay back here and film a video for anyone on YouTube who's thinking about visiting in the bath, oh my God, I can't believe I'm showing you this. But I'm just gonna show you because all the bathrooms you've probably heard of this do have those famous Toto toilets. Okay. This concludes the bathroom tour. Even the wall, beautiful. Look at that. All right. Well, that's it. That concludes my walking tour around the Sensei Lanai, the Four Seasons Resort and Hotel. Thank you so much for watching my video. Like I said, you know what I'm going to say right now. I'm, I'm not sponsored by this hotel. Nobody paid me to be here. I make these videos for you on YouTube or my friends online just to show them what a real hotel is like. If you like this video, will you do me a favor? Press the like button. Leave me a comment. Maybe subscribe. Somebody else is coming. I don't want to be annoying. So I'm going to go to some more resorts soon, and I will share the best parts of all of those here on my channel or maybe on my blog. All right. Thank you for watching. Leave me any feedback, too. If you want these videos to be better, let me know how I can make them better there in the comments. Thanks for watching my video. Let me know when are you going to the Sensei Lanai, and what are you looking forward to? Bye, and have a great day.